The Komodo dragon is an ancient animal species, which is also the largest and most dangerous lizard in the world. Although they can only be found on Komodo Island in Indonesia and other surrounding islands, they come from Australia. According to fossil records they originate from Northeast Australia and migrated to Indonesia during the Ice Age. This happened around 900,000 years ago until they completely disappeared from Australia around 50,000 years ago. The Komodo dragon is the largest species of the Pharanidae family and the largest lizard in the world with an average length of 2 to 3 meters and a weight of up to 150 kilograms. They were very strong reptiles with long bodies, thick-skinned, muscular legs, and powerful tails. They used their tails for fighting and supporting themselves when standing on their hind legs. They have long, sharp and curved claws that are often used for digging in soil or sand. Komodo dragons are solitary predators and they are able to cover a distance of around 20 kilometers every day. They are also known to be excellent swimmers who travel from one island to another over relatively long distances. They are the top predators in their habitat because so far it is not known that there are other large carnivorous animals in their geographical distribution. With their large and muscular bodies, Komodo dragons can take down prey many times larger than them such as deer, pigs, water buffalo, and even humans. Their large bodies and fearsome reputation make them one of the most famous and most feared animals in the world. Komodo dragons are able to see up to 300 meters, but because their retinas only have cone cells, these animals cannot see well in the dark of night. Komodo dragons are able to distinguish colors but are not very able to distinguish stationary objects, and uniquely these giant reptiles do not have a sense of hearing, even though they have ear holes. Komodo dragons use their tongues to smell their prey like most eyes. Komodo tongues catch odor particles in the air and then place them in an organ on the roof of their mouth called the Jacobson organ which functions to analyze the signs of the odor. With the help of the wind and their habit of turning their heads left and right when walking, they can detect the presence of carrion from 4 to 9 kilometers away. Their nostrils only function for breathing and not smelling, because they do not have odoroceptive membranes in their noses. Komodo dragons look scary because they have 60 sharp and serrated teeth, however their bite is relatively weak compared to other animals. Like lizard species in general, Komodo dragons can only produce a bite force of around 500 to 600 psi. Technically, a Komodo bite is not strong enough to cause damage to humans or other animals, but contrary to popular belief, Komodo dragons are venomous animals. They have enough venom to kill animals and humans within hours. 
It is widely believed that Komodo dragons do not have venom glands, and that their deadly bite comes from the amount of bacteria in their mouths. This makes perfect sense, considering that Komodo dragons are scavengers, who often eat rotten animal flesh. However in 2009 researchers discovered that the Komodo dragon is in fact venomous, and is one of the few venomous lizards on the planet. But instead of injecting poison into its prey like snakes, Komodo poison actually seeps into the victim's wounds. Komodo poison glands will flow and be able to speed up the bleeding of wounds on their prey and prevent them from clotting. That is why most of the Komodo victims die from blood loss, even if the prey runs away they will end up dying and the Komodo dragon will find their carcasses thanks to its olfactory abilities. As a solitary animal, the Komodo dragon only gathers with other Komodo dragons when eating or when breeding during the mating season, which takes place between May and August. During this period, male Komodo dragons often fight with other males to win over females and their territory. Two male Komodo dragons will grapple while standing using their hind legs and then push and hit each other with their front legs. The losing Komodo dragon will fall and be locked to the ground. The two male Komodo dragons can vomit or defecate when preparing to fight. Then the winner of the fight will stick out his long tongue at the female's body to see her acceptance. After mating, female Komodo dragons usually lay their eggs in holes in the ground, depressions in hillsides, or abandoned bird nests. However, Komodo dragons prefer to store their eggs in abandoned nests. The average Komodo nest contains 20 eggs. The female lies on top of the eggs to incubate and protect them until they hatch after incubating for 7 to 8 months. The hatching process is a painstaking effort for Komodo dragons who emerge from the egg shell after tearing it with their sharp teeth. After successfully tearing the egg shell, baby Komodo dragons can lie in their egg shells for several hours, before in turn starting to dig out of the nest. When they hatch, these babies are very vulnerable to being preyed upon by other predators. Young Komodo dragons spend their first years in trees, a place that is relatively safe for them from attacks by predators, including cannibalistic adult Komodo dragons, which sometimes prey on young monitor lizards that they manage to kill. Komodo dragons take three to five years to mature, and they can live more than 50 years.